Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades posted on Friday, 16th of September. This uh, trade and clip was shared by MF. As you see here, uh, he's trading CAD Japanese Yen and he's uh, looking at the macro 30 minute charts and see the downtrend and also the five minute structural chart shows breakout after the consolidation and pullback got completed and uh, the price broke at this level and you can see the downtrend in the one minute chart and uh, you see as a channel so with proper entry and exit and a stop loss with two targets uh, he has started the trades and aiming for the support area here first target and the dynamic channel lower part for the second targets so first target is filled now these are trades from live market now waiting for pullback updating the dynamic channel if this channel break he exit manually and did that so two trades were closed with profit uh, with high win rate and good risk to reward ratio thanks for mf for sharing your trades with us uh, the next clip was shared by mg and uh, he's shorting the Nasdaq CFD using Forex Broker. Again, you see similar pattern downtrend in the 30 minute macro and a channel of the downtrend in five minute and alignment of one minute trading charts. So all is aligned, very low risk area, high probability trading area, algo one, two, three passed. Entry signal is correct, other algos are correct and the first target was reached here and aiming for the second target and managing that manually so he exit here because the pullback was uh, strong uh, so thanks mg for sharing your trades with us uh, the next trade was shared by castro or global instructor he is shorting the us 30 which is cfd of dow jones and also trading the same on in form of futures on the fund providers account this is his downtrend channel on the one minute chart which is aligned with higher time frames so it's high property trading area and proper algo four and five and also good setting of the targets two targets were selected and you can see he's already in profit and a stop loss was moved to this level to save the profits and aiming for the targets on the other side of channel which is sitting on the, the static support area and it's the same area that it hits the dynamic support area so thanks Castro for sharing your trades with us so the next trade is from Yan or Global Instructor that is shorting the Nasdaq CFD using Forex Broker. As you see the downtrend channel on the four hours macro and the same on 30 minute the structural chart with the channel on the trading charts which is three minute. You see opportunity to enter here and short the Nasdaq uh, for fast skull. That's the entry point, uh, which is correct based on algo 4 5. And that's the target in the middle of channel based on exit strategy number one. Thanks, Jan, for sharing your trades with us. These are clips of live trades from my trades uh, from after opening of the New York market. After seven minutes, the steel market is in sideway and very high volatility so volatility filter and algo one doesn't allow us to take any trades so i wait for this uh, upper and lower channel to break to become trendy so i can take profits uh, that are out of this range so after this happened it's now 10 minutes past uh, the market broke this below here went up and went down and volatility got smoother so when this broke i took the upward long several times and take profit here 
when it went down I went to the short size and again when it went up I took uh, long profits on the S&P 500 and the result after 10 minutes uh, was I reached the 85% win rate from 21 trades profit factor of 3.38 with the largest win and loss is the same so uh, you can say that from three losing trades we had $145 loss and from winning trades 82 on the average hope these trades are useful for you and let us know if you have any questions have a wonderful day and weekend